First at four, we're honoring those who serve. Back in February, we told you about the widow of a Navy veteran whose home was in bad shape. But then a group of volunteers with Operation Enduring Gratitude stepped up to help. And today was the big day as Jean LaVar got to see her new home and meet the volunteers who made it happen. An all-American house, freshly colored in patriotic love. It took 18 months of hard work to get to this point. 200 volunteers, including veterans, students, and those connected to the veteran community, put in thousands of hours for a total rebuild of this house that was built in the early 50s, a home that had fallen into disrepair. There are resources in place that helps a majority of the veterans, but there are some that fall through the gaps. This one fell through the gap. Charlie Ellis is an Army veteran. He founded Operation Enduring Gratitude to help people exactly like Gene. Jean LaVar's husband, Thomas, served two years in the Navy as a payload specialist. He passed away last January. He always was proud of his service. There we go. Now his home is ready to serve, too. We modernized electrical. We've got showers that she can walk into. Yes. yes. It's fantastic. Oh, I think it's wonderful. We know that the families serve and sacrifice right along with them. People that love on our veteran community, all here today just sharing the love, their time, and their generosity. What a great organization. 12 News is honoring the courage, dedication, and sacrifice of those in our armed forces, and we want to share the stories and pictures of the veterans who are closest to you. If you'd like to submit your Those Who Serve story and picture for a chance to be featured on the air, just go to 12news.com slash those who serve.